Now at 10, when a Paris family noticed flooding in the yard next door, they called police. When deputies showed up, everyone got a big surprise. They didn't find anyone living inside the house, but they did find a major illegal marijuana growing operation. And Kick of Eye's Nicole Comstock is live in Paris where she spoke with the neighbors. Nicole? Susie and Jeff, we also spoke with a homeowner over the phone this evening. She tells me she'd been renting this property out for about a year now and actually just finished collecting a rent payment from the people who were supposed to be living here. She says she had no idea anything illegal was going on inside. The ice cream truck rolls right on by the front of this two-story home in Paris, where a clipping from a pot plant rests right in the driveway. Behind this festive front door, deputies found 2,000 pot plants, a full-scale grow operation running right under neighbors' noses. So 2,000 plants next door, and they kept it completely under wraps? Yeah, not at all. I, didn't, I never smelled it. The only thing Mike noticed was water, a lot of water, pouring out of the garage and flooding his front yard. After a couple of days, his family finally called police. Honestly, um, we thought like maybe like the owners had passed or something while they were like showering. But when deputies made entry to perform a welfare check, they didn't find any people inside. It's still a mystery who set up shop here, but deputies shut it down. Off camera, one neighbor told us she rarely saw anyone come to the home. And when she did, those people wore masks over their mouths. I can't believe it. It's incredible. Gabriella says she's heard about grow houses popping up in nearby neighborhoods, but I never imagined they would be two doors away from me because nothing really happens here. The Riverside County Sheriff's Department says its marijuana eradication team has been cracking down on illegal grows at the direction of the sheriff. That the altered wiring often found inside is also an extreme fire hazard to surrounding neighborhoods. It was uh, a real concern for someone's life, and I'm glad to have that out of my neighborhood. And the Riverside County Sheriff's Department says if you suspect something similar might be going on at a home in your neighborhood, call authorities immediately so that they can open up an investigation. Reporting live in Paris, Nicole Comstock, KCAL 9 News.